we start with one hour chart okay as you can see based on one hour chart even when the price was here we mentioned the ways moving is really corrective because when we have this kind of the corrective move we can get whatever the trade we get with a short term trade even we mentioned my last analysis for example we could have entry above the stop the only things was we get the short term trade and having entry above the top we didn't suggest it because the wheel it was moving okay now we want to see how long we will be within this move because I mean, the corrective move whether we can expect the price to drop or we can expect to get a bigger correction then from there we look for buying how we can trade it okay by the way we start with the daily chart based on daily chart we have been seeing this one okay now we want to see if based on daily we get the correction here we can confirm this is the reversal and this is the start of the up move okay and but right now we cannot confirm it because if we will move to forward chart we can, this is what we see when we have this kind of the move even this one can continue a bit higher even the this top but trading within this kind of the cool move it's not really good because uh for example if you move to one hour chart we will see it because every time for example if you get the buy from here the price can drop and again even you put the entry above this it does mean every time the price break the previous low it can drop and it's like the way it's trending is an uptrend if you put our line here okay but it's not moving very really sharp okay the only thing is if we want to trade we consider it as a short-term trade all right by the way because when we have the, the reason is we can i mean we, if we trade we i mentioned any trade will be a short-term trade because mostly when we have this kind of the move we can expect the price to drop that's why we call it a short-term trade because we are not going to come we cannot confirm how high it can go all right even uh, based on forward chart explain this one can continue move a bit higher even can continue to beat this stop but we know that when we have this kind of the corrective move, the possibility of the price to drop is very high. That's why we don't want to buy within the corrective move and we see suddenly the price to drop, then we need to see. I mean, we will be like, rather than making profit, we make a loss. We, then we don't know how to manage it. By the way, no one to see how we can trade it. First of all, the way it's moving is really corrective. For me, if I want to trade, mostly, if we put this one as a correction relative to this, if we get one more drop, then any buy from there, we can will be more interested. And again, when we have this kind of the corrective move, the possibility the price drop is a lot. And if the price didn't drop, even this move a bit higher, if we want to look for buy, if we get a bigger correction for buy, this is where we look for buy. But if this, the price continue and keep the uptrend, similar to what we have here, what I draw, the only trade is I'm um, the only way we can trade we look for the short term trade based on lower time frame and if we move to one hour chart also based on one hour chart we don't have any trade setup if there is a continuation any trade will be short term as long as we get the profit similar to what we have here break the previous high we start to manage the best thing is if we get the one down move whether break this from break, break this low or not if break this low is better for us then from there we can look for buy that's why when the price was here i mentioned since the price haven't broke this low any buy will be short term buy because I, I mentioned what we get with a corrective move this is what we get and if the price didn't drop the only time we can buy if we get the bigger correction for buy i mean it's yeah, similar to what i draw here just as an example then from there we can look for buy because right now we can see the price have broke this top okay we don't want to buy here and the suddenly the price drop or it turned to a bigger correction for next move we don't want to buy at this top okay and how about the price start sharply move from here the only way if we get the sharp move we see the next flag then we trade it we want to confirm that this correction the, the i mean this move is finished then from there we can make it I mean we can look for buy by the way right now we don't have anything so we just follow the chart and we see what we get if i see any update then i will share thanks